Hi everyone, welcome back to another cookbang. Yay! So today I am going to fry a bunch of things. We have a lot to do, so let's just get started. Um, I am heating up the oil, but before I do that, um, I have a lot to do. I don't even know where to begin, to be honest. So I have my vegetables here. These are for a little later. So I'm actually going to make some I'm gonna make like a potato ground beef croquet um, so it's actually really really simple I'll turn this off I don't want to overheat it so we're gonna need some ground beef okay Yeah, you all of it. Okay, and then so I have my ground beef, and then I'm going to add my potatoes. I microwave them for microwave them for like six minutes. I microwave it with the skin and then peeled it off, which is so much easier when it's hot. So mashed potatoes. Here we go. Here we go. I have some chopped onions, Worcestershire, and some ketchup. That's probably all that I'm gonna need. I'm gonna use my hand. It's easier that way. I feel like I could add another like maybe half a potato but I just go with this today. <laughs> I have chopped onions. Mmm, oh, the onions are so spicy. <sighs> That'd be all worth it. Okay, I'm going to I think I guess I could I have extra breadcrumbs. I don't know if I'll add it. Okay, I'll add it. I feel like the potato should be enough to hold the meat together. But I'm just going to add like a little bit of breadcrumbs and then let's add some ketchup It's my new bottle of ketchup. I have completely empty refrigerator right now So every time I go shopping for mukbang, it's just like uh, I mean like I had to buy everything new Ugh, Man, the cap broke um, Because now I don't have anything And I have some Worcestershire Just like I think that's good Wipe it. Should I add an egg? Oh, then I have to get up. <laughs> Let's add one egg. One egg. It already smells so good. Mm. Oh, so hungry. I am not in the mood to do this right now. I am so hungry. Okay. So, okay, this one is like gone. Okay, so, and then I'm gonna need my breadcrumbs. What do I need? Okay, so I need breadcrumbs some flour and some eggs so I can't get put everything on here so let's try this I think this will work I'm gonna keep my flour down here I'm really thinking about putting my salt and pepper just next to me you know like um I'm glad that this area is like pretty empty for me right now and I have some salt uh, because as I am filming cookbangs, I think I'll know better what I'll need, actually need, instead of like decorations. So maybe I'll put like little carts. I do have one right now, but that one just kind of is too tall. So I feel like it won't really do much help. Some black pepper. Like in the beginning, I actually wanted to put like ice maker or like a mini refrigerator. 
where like the ones that you could see what's inside the fridge but i don't know if that would be as practical but maybe i'll put like a little like um yeah a little thing where i have all the sauces and my utensils like the basic stuff that i'll i know that i'll use every time i film cook bang. let's make them into little balls I don't mind them like thicker because I'd rather have them like stay intact. Is it? I think it's flour. Yeah, it's flour first. Sorry, I know you guys can't see, but it's really nothing special. And then some eggs. Yes, and then some breadcrumbs. My gosh, my hands are already so messy. Messy mukbang. I might not fry all of them right now because uh, I do have other stuff to fry. There you go. I think we're good. Okay, let's make another one. Some flour. These are just regular, just flour. Nothing special. Nothing like not. It's not one of those Korean like pancake flour or anything. Just basic, basic cake flour. Okay. Oh boy, it's making me so hungry. make one where it's more like a croquet looking like this flower quick flower oh this one's thick I think I could make one more. This is a small one. Okay. So for the eggs, when I use to uh, deep fry something, I make sure that I run it through a strainer because if you don't, like you don't, I feel like it just it doesn't coat very well. messy here I'm gonna just kind of wipe it down really quick okay oh yeah oh yeah definitely this one can be flipped over Ooh, boy, this is so good So next, I'm going to fry the vegetables. I have this red uh, garnet, garnet. Um, so it's kind of like red potato, red sweet potatoes. I have uh, some white mushrooms and some onions. I'm going to fry them a little differently. But these are turning out really well. Visual wise, it looks pretty decent. <laughs> So I already have my tempura batter that I kept it in the refrigerator because I want to keep it cool. But it's like regular uh, cake, flour, egg yolk, and just some cold water. That's it. This is out. I think I could take the first one out. Okay. Nice and hot and toasty.
nasty gunks out of the way. I'm going to start with some potatoes because I feel like these are going to take longer. Lightly mix them. Not much. The oil is not very clean. It's not dirty, but it's not very clear. Okay, let, let, let's actually let's try it and see what happens. <laughs> Don't you love the mentality? Let's just do it and see what happens. Fuck it. I'm gonna start with my tempura. <laughs> Is this how I do it? I don't remember how I used to. I'm like almost thinking that I should like coat it with something else before. I don't remember this. But it's gonna catch all the nasty stuff. Mm, it's not bad. I can actually clean it out now. I'm like almost blinded right now because of the studio lights. <laughs> I'm just gonna assume that I'm catching everything. <laughs> oh. You know what? I, I think I wanted to get carrot, but I don't know. But I saw this potato. I'm like, oh, it might, I thought it would be like the Korean kuguma, like a sweet potato, but it's not. So we'll see how it tastes. Okay, and then I'm gonna do my white mushrooms. These are one of my favorite things to fry. So good. What happens? Oh, maybe the oil is not steep enough. But it'll survive. So heat a little bit, and then I'm going to add more oil. Am I like getting red? I am not drunk. It's the heat. 
Done. Okay, this is almost done. So I'm gonna just start eating. I have my favorite. I do not want to throw any of this in the oil. <laughs> Okay, I think I can turn this off. Okay. Oh. These guys are like so burnt looking, but I don't think they are. <laughs> okay, this one looks this one looks a little burnt. So I don't have my tempura dipping sauce. But I did try to make my own with soy sauce and like mirin. Uh, what else goes in here? And some sugar. My little cup. Add my sauce. Oh, nice. Okay, I'm gonna. I am scared that I don't even know if this is cooked. But here we go. beat this oh my goodness to tell you the truth you know when i filmed that omurice and uh, like a, ham a hamburg steak i wanted to do this but then i didn't have breadcrumbs mm -hmm. oh. Oh. so So funny, a little behind the story on that video. I was like, I really want to eat this and I don't have breadcrumbs. And I didn't go out and get it. So I was like, let's be creative. So I, I, I only like, if I even had like, um, like bread slices and I would toast it and, and I would like mix it up or whatever, I didn't even have that. So I'm like, okay, I have bagels. So I tried it with the bagels, but it was just too stale or it was just too wet. Maybe I could have, I don't know. I don't know if you guys have ever done it, but if you guys have any alternatives to breadcrumbs, let me know. Wow, you guys, this is so good. Mm. Oh. I'm so exhausted. I had a very busy morning. I was running some errands for um, Tong as well. So I'm so, oh, I'm so exhausted. I do wish that I had some like pickle radish or kimchi, but I'm sure in no time I'm gonna have my refrigerator and my pantry is gonna be full. I'm gonna do, I actually really wanna try this onion. Sweetness that comes from onion, so good. Mm. 
Oh, it's still freaking hot. Mm -hmm. mm. Try my mushrooms. Guys, what? Let's try the potato or oh, whatever this is. You know, even carrot when you deep fry it is so good. When I first had fried like a tempura carrot, I thought it was potato, like sweet potato, because it was so sweet. Mmm. <laughs> Guys, this is pretty good. Wow. Mmm. What is this? It was like a red garnet. I look it up. Oh, it's, I think this is yam almost. Mmm. I like it. It's pretty good. The sauce turned out really well. And let me tell you, I put in a lot of sugar. That's the key. <laughs> I love the mushrooms. Oh, these are so good. Another one. <clears throat> I'll just eat two and then I'm gonna save the rest. This, this is a lot. Mmm! Mmm, God! I cannot get over the taste. Mmm! I am desperate for some kimchi right now. <sighs> oh my gosh, if I added canned corn in, sweet corn in here, game over. GG. So good. I should have looked into it more, but I kind of almost don't taste the potato. <laughs> I 
I mean, I, I knew I added too little, but oh my god, is my ear getting infected again? Uh, I'm gonna end the video here. I hope you guys enjoyed this cookbang, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye! Thanks for watching!